Hi, my name is J.R. Bjornsson. I make videos from Central Alberta, Canada, talking about uh, what it's like being visually impaired and how it makes me feel. Sometimes I'll even share my technology with you and uh, bring you into my world. Today's episode continues to be all about my eSight glasses and uh, certain things I notice about myself when I wear them. One of the big things I notice about myself is uh, I keep my eyes open most of the time wearing the glasses, but sometimes my eyes will still automatically close. Like if I'm thinking about something, they will automatically close. Or if I'm trying to use the glasses, I'll often look for a tiny second and then I'll look away like my eyeballs will go up into my head. Don't know why, it's, it, they've always just done that. Yeah, I have an eye condition called Peter's Anomaly and uh, for some reason my eyes just do that on their own. I remember when I first got these glasses uh, two years ago, I was working with a company, a government company here in uh, central Alberta called EPSS. And what EPSS was supposed to do was help you find a job. If you had a, a mental disability or a physical disability, they would help you find employment. If you suffered from anxiety, depression, all that, they would help you find employment. You might find this hard to believe, but uh, they did not help me find employment. They tried. God bless them. I'm still friends with some of the people who work there. They definitely tried, but uh, it just goes back to the whole. This is why I, I can't. This is why it's tough for me to find work. This is why I some days feel like I should give up. But I, you know, I still keep trying. We'll find something that works for me one day. I just found out they are opening a Harvey soon in Gasoline Alley in Red Deer. I might apply there. I've been at Harvey's before. And now that with these fancy glasses, maybe I'd actually be able to see what I'm doing. <laughs> oh, good times. But um, I remember when I first got these glasses, I uh, was at an interview with this lovely, lovely individual. And I found myself just looking at her as she talked, like looking at her face and just really mesmerized how we can, some people talk with their hands and other people don't. Like me, I often talk crass my hands are crossed. But if I get really emotional, sometimes I'll bring my hands up to express myself. But usually, I just cross my arms like this. And yeah, apparently this is bad body language. This says, God, don't hurt me. I'm protecting myself. You know, you know what I mean? But the coolest thing about these glasses is I remember when I started communicating with people, even on Zoom, I was able to see people. I took this uh, meditation class two years ago about, uh, actually I think it was last year, I took this medica me medication class, meditation class. I took this meditation class and it was called Mindfulness and Meditation. And I remember I took it and I was able to watch everybody on the Zoom call with the glasses on. And it was just beautiful, man, it was mind blowing. Uh, there is a way to connect HDMI to the glasses so I could have actually just saw what my computer screen saw, but uh, everything for me needs to be magnified. Even on my Mac computer, everything always needs to be magnified. So these glasses help me 60% of the time, but I would still love to read with them. I still can't, but maybe if I practice, keep using the glasses more, you know, I'll be able to read with them. These are called the eSight 4, and uh, you can just Google search eSight, that's lowercase e, capital S, I, G, H, T, 4, as in the number 4. All right, well, you know what? That about does it for this edition of the Updote, Updote, Upload. My name is J.R. Bjornsson, and I hope you're enjoying these videos. I will, be, I will be back tomorrow with more episodes of the Eastside Glasses and talking about my use of them. And uh, I'll talk to you real soon, all right? Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Be cool, be kind, and above all, be yourself. It is who we love, and I will chat with you in 24 hours. Bye-bye.